What's up? I'm Jacob, a.k.a. Crouton. And I'm Teddy, a.k.a. Hollywood. And we're from Family Force 5. I actually picked up the sticks when I was like five or six, but I didn't have enough money when I was five or six, so I didn't get my own set until I was 13. So I really started playing drums at 13. From there, my brothers and I had a band. It was really bad. Um, and we just kind of progressed uh, from there. And uh, it wasn't until about 10 years after that we started Family Force 5. So fast forward, uh, to about 2013, uh, I met this dude and a random like club show. One of my friend's bands was playing and I was there. And I remember coming up to him and going, man, you're so good and so young, I just want to punch you in the face right now. He did. Yeah, he straight up punched me. I punched him right in the face because he was so good. And then uh, when my bro decided to like step down as lead singer and I was like, uh, what are we gonna do? And uh, we made the decision that I was gonna go out front um, from behind the drums, which is totally weird and different, but awesome. Um, I called this dude and he said yes. I freaked out. Yeah, it was great. Yeah, so, but now we both get to play on stage. So we got two drummers on stage and what's better than two drummers? Probably three but we don't have that. Until Questlove calls us back, we won't have three drummers. <laughs> exactly. My setup on stage, I kind of took some notes from Jacob, and I took some notes from, uh, I love the killer's drummer, Ronnie. I feel like he just sat down and was like, how big do they make cymbals? Give me those cymbals. And Jacob kind of had, he, start, he uses a 24K ride, and it's, I mean, it's the biggest symbol I've ever played. And I was like, you know what, I think I'm gonna copy you on that one. And I always played uh, a 21 inch sweet ride as a crash, breaking the rules, rides all over the place. They got 15 inch uh, master sound hi hats. They just fill it all in. With this type of music, it's like, there's so much going on, so many different little sounds, so it's like, it's really fun to have symbols that you can crash on, then be real dainty and gentle with them, or just, most of the time, just Bash. beat the crap out of them. Yeah. That's my game. Yeah. I have a baby kit on stage that we call uh, Wally because it's on these like, uh, <laughs> golf it's cart on this wheels. like golf cart setup <laughs> that we roll out. But I have a pair of 14-inch uh, Constantinople hats that are divine. Those, to me, are the best symbols ever. And then I also have a, a K Light Ride 24-inch, which I have, I've been playing that symbol for seven or eight years now, and it's the best. And my absolute favorite symbol in the world is the Crash of Doom. Uh, I think if we had a side project, we would probably call it the Crash of Doom. Yeah. <laughs>